Hi everyone, today's headlines. Nagaland, salaries to be paid through e-pay bill system from November. Dimapur police informs on arms possession. Nearly all of COVID-19 infections across the globe are Delta. China overtakes US to become world's richest nation. Border districts on alert as Kerala Wayanad reports norovirus cases. News in details. Nagaland, salaries to be paid through e-pay bill system from November. The Nagaland Finance Department has been decided to introduce the payment of salaries and wages through e-pay bill system effective from November 2021, the state DIPR informed on Tuesday. The decision was based on comprehensive data on employees collected from all departments by the per Personal Information Management System, CEL, Personal and Administrative Reform Department, the DIPR informed. Dimapur Police informs on arms possession. The Dimapur Police PRO on Tuesday directed all arms license holders under the Dimapur district to comply with Section 32 of the Arms Amendment Act 2019. Under the Act, a license in possession of more than two firearms is permitted to retain with him any two of such firearms or shall deposit his remaining firearm with the officer in charge of the nearest police station or with the licensed dealer or where such person is a member of armed forces of the union in a unit armory. Nearly all of COVID-19 infections across globe are Delta. The Delta variant of COVID-19 now accounts for almost all the existing coronavirus infection across the world, a report has now said, while vaccines have been able to defend against the deadly virus, the scientific community across the world continues to be on alert. According to a Reuters report, the Delta variant, which was first detected in India in December 2020, is the most worrisome version of the SARS-CoV-2 virus. According to the U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, the Delta variant is two times more contagious than the other variants of COVID-19. The variant, it is learned, can trigger coronavirus faster than the other variant of the virus. China overtakes U.S. to become world's richest nation as global wealth surges. China has gone past the U.S to become the richest nation in the world, according to a new research report. The report, authored by the research wing of McKinsey & Co., said that global wealth had tripled over the last two decades from $1.156 trillion in the year 2000 to $514 trillion in 2020. The report has been prepared after examining the national balance sheet of 10 countries representing more than 60% of the world income. According to the data revealed, China has accounted for almost one-third of the staggering rise in global wealth. The wealth of the nation surged from $7 trillion in the year 2000 to $120 trillion in 2020. The data tracks the period from one year before the country became a member of World Trade Organization, which speeded up the rise of its economy. Economy. The report analyzed the national balance sheet of 10 countries, which accounted for over 60% of the world's income apart from China and US. The countries in the report included Germany, France, UK, Japan, Sweden, Mexico, Canada and Australia. As for the US, the net worth of the country increased to almost $90 trillion in two decades. In both US and China, the two biggest global economies, more than two-thirds of the wealth is concentrated in just 10% of the richest household, about 68% of the global net worth is stored in real estate, as per the report. Border district on alert as Kerala's Vayanad report norovirus cases. The district administration of Kodangu and Dakshina Kannada have sounded high alert following the reports of norovirus cases in Kerala's Vayanad. The norovirus infection was reported among 13 students of a veterinary college in Vayanad district and at least a dozen more are said to have been showing the symptoms. The district administrators of Kodagu and Dakshina Kannada, which share a border with Kerala, have instructed the field surveillance staff to safeguard water sources shared at, at the community level like community wells. Consuming drinking water disinfected with chlorine has been advised. That's all for now. To get the status news, don't forget to subscribe this channel. Thank you.